I too at one time thought that pole dance and hijab would be contradictory until I went to my first couple of classes. Hello, Wada. My name is Neda. I'm a 34 year old nurse practitioner. I live in Los Angeles. I am an Iranian woman and I pole dance. I went to my first pole dance class two and a half years ago. Uh, I just went because I wanted to try it, maybe even as a joke. Um, I was not expecting to stay. I thought I would just go for a couple of classes and that's it. But I stayed because the women in the class were so welcoming. I felt it was a very body positive environment and it was just a very difficult thing to do. So I felt like I wanted to keep challenging myself and I stayed. And I thought I was going to keep my pole journey completely private. I was not expecting to put anything public. But um, even when I went to my first pole class, I did not think that hijab and pole dance um, could be reconciled together. I thought they were going to be contradictory. And that's why I was intending on just keeping everything private and to myself and only going to women's only classes. But I started to put my journey publicly because this stuff is hard. Pulling up myself on the pole doing tricks and everything is difficult and I took a lot of pride in it and I wanted to share it I don't think that any of the movements I'm doing are sexual um, I don't I'm not showing any skin so um, there's gonna be people that think what I'm doing is still wrong and that's okay I used to think that way too um, but I'm not here to convince people that what I'm doing is right. They are okay to believe I'm going to hell, and I guess I'll just see you there. the Arab women, Muslim women, whatever kind of woman you are, um, just remember that the haters that come after you about your appearance, about your faith, whatever, um, they're not going to be there for your successes. They're not going to have anything to say about when you actually do succeed. Um, they are there to find something to hate about you because they have their own pain that they want to project onto somebody and you happen to be the target that day. So uh, just remember they don't pay your bills. So uh, do what makes you happy.